When I was born, my mom and dad were breaking up. They had a marriage that was falling apart after only a few years. And so when I was an infant, my father had already left the home and my mom was already in a relationship with the woman that she would be in a relationship with all the way up until I was 19 when my mom died. And growing up that way, I saw a lot of the good in my situation. I was close to my mother's partner, very close to her. And I felt like I got a lot of love from both of them. And it was a low conflict relationship. So in a lot of ways, it was the best case scenario that you could have. I'm very aware of the fact that having two loving adults can be a positive thing in a child's life, particularly when you're young and there's instability or there's a crisis. It's helpful to have two people there. And I did grow up with a certain level of tolerance and open-mindedness about things. I, I was very worldly. One of the things about the gay community is for all that I tend to criticize it for the way that they deal with children, the gay community is very, a very worldly community. It tends to collect a lot of people from all around the world because there's this one thing that connects them, their sexual orientation. So I grew up very knowledgeable and, and I would say we were sophisticated. We were a sophisticated family growing up. Whether that's good or bad, I'm not sure, but uh, so there were positives about it. The negatives were I didn't have a relationship with my dad and I was exposed to the heaviness of the gay lifestyle really much too young and, and that did harm me.